Hello. Uh, I guess this is my first vlog. Uh, and I guess uh, I should probably start up with the topic. Um, hello, and welcome to this vlog. Uh, I'm new to this, to say the least. But one thing's for sure um, is that uh, I think I'm going to take this vlog into the direction of uh, talking about um, some of the aspects and interests that I have that I've been doing and dealing with on day to day. Um, and so I guess a good start should be that. Uh, so uh, one of the more important things in my life recently is uh, I have been uh, uh, working on uh, writing. I, I It's one of my passions. Uh, I uh, one of my best outlets for emotional troubles is bringing out, bringing it out in a writing sense to be well handled by in characters and so forth. Uh, but I don't really have a lot of issues myself. But I do uh, like to peek into areas where there would be issues, like in the sense of um, of uh, personal strife and so forth, like the troubles of um, an entire city or so forth, or the, that place, um, that stress being put on one person and so on, and other senses like that. Uh, I like putting my mind in other places. I think I have a very good knack for um, uh, getting a sense of the world reacting in a good, in a negative and or good way. And uh, one of the many ways I've been doing it is through uh, story writing for my D&D campaign. Um, and it's it's nice practice for for very many d uh, dynamics, from a third person dynamic to a first person dynamic coming from the players and or from other players' perspectives depending on the events that happen. Um, one of my favorite things to do in my campaign is to bring amongst a um, what well, I'll say the least uh, uh, I'll bring up some possibly important character or some very uh, many. NPCs that uh, are very unimportant and um, what I'll have them go through is I don't know some issue in where they live um, maybe monsters are, are uh, terrorizing their work so they can't make money um, and so on top of being in danger for their life they're also in danger of economy um, like uh, uh, you know, in their money sense. I don't know why I couldn't come up with the correct wording for that. But, uh, yeah, uh, that's just a little bit of what I do. Uh, and that's just on a small scale. Like, like I could have done, like, a small a small town, like, where, say, the whole conversation point is um, the village elder of this... Uh, not the village elder, the, uh, the mayor of this small town um, is working very hard to make sure that uh, they can procure money and income of uh, like you know circulation through uh travelers and um other situations but because uh the trading routes have been kind of um because the the trading route have been issued by goblins or so forth uh it's harder for them to make money it's harder for their city to keep a standing and a name in this area and so now they're probably putting what little money they have left up to adventurers to handle that situation which would definitely be like a in a real world comparison would be like i don't know a uh a small town having troubles with a bear population or something not saying that bears repopulate that fast but you know like maybe some invasive species and so they have to get some kind of relocators or something like that or an exterminator if they're going to the extreme sense um and yeah that's just <laughs> thinking on it on like a uh, a simple world state and that's not even including like uh the interactions of small town people of that town uh the interactions between each other and yeah I, I, this this is just a bit a bit of information i've also been um uh taking in information and experiences from video games uh the the singular strifes of characters in video games uh, i have a very large ten attention span to um rpgs in the sense because they do a very good job of individualizing these things uh, but to say the least, this is just some some of these small um, topics and aspects that I am very, very enthralled with that I really love to talk about and think about. Uh, if anything, I would feel free to continue going on. So if I actually do post this, uh, I wouldn't be afraid to uh, say to like, share, and subscribe, I guess. <laughs> it's so weird to hear it from this end. Uh, I never thought I'd hear that from my own voice. All right, bye.